Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June the 27th of 2020. Well, it is titled Eclipse under the ISS. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image taken from the International Space Station, which is in a low Earth orbit, just a couple hundred miles up above the surface of the Earth. And you can actually see a cargo spacecraft in the foreground there uh, that was probably bringing supplies up to the International Space Station. And then looking out below, we can see the Earth. And if you look off towards the a horizon there, you can easily see the curvature of the Earth showing that the Earth is of course a sphere. And you can see the atmosphere, the hay blue haze would be the atmosphere sticking up above. But what we're especially noticing in this image is the dark splotch there in the center of the image. And that is actually the shadow of the moon. So like any other solid object, the moon would cast a shadow and that shadow would extend through space. And if things are lined up right, then that shadow would fall on the Earth. Now, when the moon's shadow falls on the Earth, we have a solar eclipse. So any place in that darkened region, if you were standing there on the Earth, then you would see part of the sun being blocked out by the moon. And in this case, this is the eclipse from June the 21st, uh, almost a week ago now, where the moon passed in front of the sun and gave us an annular eclipse. So towards the center of that dark patch, you would have seen an annular eclipse, meaning that the moon would have been directly in front of the sun, but a little bit too small to be able to block it out entirely. So there would still be a ring of sunlight or an annulus around the edge of the moon, giving it its name as an annular eclipse. Further away from that, you would have seen a partial uh, solar eclipse where a portion of the moon would have been blocked out. And the further you get away from the center and out towards the edges of that shadow, the less of the less of the sun would be blocked during that eclipse. Now, of course, it's a different view of the eclipse than what we've had over the last uh, couple pictures that we've looked at that showed the eclipse. And in this case, because we're looking at it from above, we're looking down on the shadow instead of looking up towards the sun. So in yesterday's image, we saw all of the images of the sun coming through the bamboo leaves. And today we're seeing the shadow that the moon casts. So we're getting a completely different perspective on the eclipse and seeing it from a different point of view. And the space station is, of course, a way to be able to see that being up in space and able to look down upon the Earth and be able to see the shadow when an eclipse occurs. So that was our picture of the day for June the 27th of 2020. It was titled Eclipse under the ISS. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be moons and shadows. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.